does it feel to get out and see some sun after the beautiful snowstorm? Oh beautiful snowstorm? Yeah. Are, are you kidding me? People are singing play. Oh, uh, Farooq? Amazing weather, man. Amazing, Amazing weather. weather. No. Whoever Beautiful has, weather for us. Uh, whoever decided not to come are going to miss out. Yes. Maybe yes. that is my case. <laughs> now we case. know <laughs> to appreciate 40 degree weather. Yes, yes. Yeah. <laughs> hey, <laughs> yes, sir. Let's go. Okay, we are starting from here. It's supposed to start <laughs> an hour and a half ago, but that's how it is. Uh yeah? Yeah. Straight here. Yeah. Okay, we are heading out. I think there's going to be a little bit of a freeway part and then uh, we will uh, get on the back roads. Uh, yeah, this is the uh, route I haven't been on. This is north of uh, Louisville and Lake Dallas and stuff. So let's do some recording here just to get some new routes. We have Chandan in front of me, uh, Sri and Bail ahead. Beautiful uh, it's Lake Dallas. So let's see what we got here. Uh, weather is turning out beautiful, like 64 degrees. Man, I'm overdressed for this weather. I kind of have an inner layer and everything else because last ride I was freezing at 48 and it started off that way and then now it seems like it's <laughs> really warmed up and sun too. So I'm really overdressed. But uh, that's okay, it's not that bad, uh, better to be warm than be cold, I think. So, uh, uh, other than that, yeah, things are good. Uh, I tried putting uh, a brake, uh, I know, like a gear lever from Hammerhead, and it looks like uh, I wasn't sure how to do that. <laughs> it had some internal tread, I guess, but I just didn't... Uh, I have to uh, play around with it. I didn't know how to take that out. So, I will work on that uh, later on or enlist the help of some experts. <laughs> and uh, yeah, blue skies, can't ask for anything more. Beautiful weather. Sit down out on this beautiful motorcycle ride in uh, North Texas. I guess this is the uh, bridge on Lake Louisville. I've, uh, I'm not sure I've been on this bridge on a motorcycle. Probably I was. Oh, that's beautiful. Look at that. It's, it's gorgeous.
the Dallas has got so many lakes around it, most of them man-made and uh, Lake Lewis Wall is I think uh, one of the biggest uh, here, I'm guessing. It's a big uh, favorite for anybody who wants to go fishing and stuff, so it is uh, really beautiful. Uh, so pretty much uh, all the boaters are uh, out here in the summertime, you can see a little bit of ice uh, on the edges. speed limit and the guys are flying around here that's the problem I just uh, did my <laughs> uh, safety course for the previous ticket which I got in a speed trap I don't want to do that again <laughs> or you can't do it again within a year if you get a ticket beautiful Salina we took uh, all the back roads and uh, head 428 and then we came straight down here on 455 uh, so that was um, an interesting route <laughs> we are pretty much passing through about four or five miles from my house <laughs> but uh, this is my backyard It's always challenging on these group rides because if you get stuck behind traffic then for catching up you gotta speed up like crazy and then <laughs> you're going at uh, 90 miles an hour trying to catch the guys uh, so that's a bit of a hassle <laughs> but uh, it's part of uh, the group ride you gotta be careful you gotta weigh in uh, uh, the speed limit uh, with uh, the speed at which the guys are going so this is the downtown Salina Mardi Gras poster here. I guess they're celebrating Mardi Gras here. Salina tracks. Nice. signing right there that's why everybody was complete coming to a complete stop and the stop sign I was wondering what's going on why are the guys following the rules so religiously yeah there's always a reason enforcement and penalty is what makes people good citizens not not just the rules Big difference, big difference. Oh, 
Okay, looks like Sajin is going to take another break, is it? I think they're all here already. We are at the uh, usual Salina mural here at Salina. It's another small brick. The bikes lined up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because the other one I had, right? I returned it. Okay. I had another one. I had one I can just charge it while I'm in the Okay, we are back on the road again. After this stop, we're going to head out to Flying J and stop there, but then this is going to be 455. This is where the uh, another set of twisties here. Everybody tries to go as fast as they can. Now I'm going to be doing my usual slow speed stuff. practice a little bit I guess that's about it these the roads are nice uh, and clean Houses on this road. I didn't realize they built houses here. But these houses are being built on the main road. That might not be a good idea. Anyway, uh, that was a fun ride. I will go ahead and uh, ride along and. Uh, I will uh, see you guys in the next video. It's a beautiful day and it's always uh, good to be out on the road. So hang loose and ride safe. Talk to you guys later.